Here's Chief Meteorologist Chris Boone. Well, it was a fantastic day across the Lone Star State. For much of us here in the Concho Valley as well, we did see a little bit of that cloud coverage, some pop-up clouds, some little fair weather cumulus, but otherwise, everything has been mostly clear. All that rain has pushed off towards the east, seeing it move in towards the areas like Mississippi and Alabama. It's all part of that upper level low that's seeing out in Oklahoma. Again, here in Texas, mostly clear skies. You did see some of that beneficial rainfall real help, uh, really help out the area. One to two inches reported here in San Angelo. Other areas saw just under two inches. We got just under an inch in Coleman, so some very beneficial rainfall. That's going to hopefully make an impact on our drought monitor as well. Again, the best rainfall accumulation was off towards the eastern parts and northeastern parts of the Concho Valley. They saw some much welcomed rain. And that's, again, going to help out with the drought conditions, drought monitor conditions as we go into tomorrow. That's when they'll have an update for our drought monitor. And again, the area with the exceptional drought is one of the areas that saw some of the heavier rainfall. We saw flooding out towards the Brady as well as Coleman area. So again, hopefully that beneficial rainfall really starts to make an impact across the area for how dry May has been. Otherwise, today, beautiful day to get out there and make the most of it. Do see a few of those clouds out there. Temperatures stayed on the cooler side thanks to last night's cold front. 79 temperatures right now in downtown San Angelo. All thanks to those northwesterly winds at 14 miles per hour. Again, bringing in that cool air towards the area. And again, that's keeping much of the area in the upper 70s and low 80s. Do see some 80s out towards Mason, Brady, as well as Eden and Ballinger. Some upper 70s out towards Merton and El Dorado at 79 degrees. So again, well below average. Normally we'd see our averages in the low 90s. Seeing cooler temperatures even up north again as that low pressure spins up towards Oklahoma. As that pushes off towards the northeast, though, We'll be looking at warmer temperatures to start to make its return. Tonight, though, temperatures are going to stay down into the mid 50s. 55 or overnight low. Very refreshing to get out there and make the most of it. Northwesterly winds 10 to 15 miles per hour. Then going into tomorrow, still hanging on to the mostly clear skies, but the big change is going to be those winds. Start to come more out of the southwest, bringing in that warm air in towards our area. It's going to allow temperatures to begin climbing up, getting into the 90s, start to get into the mid-90s for our afternoon high, 94 here in San Angelo. Again, that's going to start a warming trend. We saw a couple of cool days. Temperatures only getting up into the 80s. Right, we're going to finish up the month of May a little bit on the warmer side, and it has been a very warm May so far, so we can start to see another chance for some records this weekend as well, and that's all going to be because of this upper level low. That pushes off towards the northeast. At ridging rebuilds across the western and central United States, allowing for those warmer temperatures as well as clear skies. So again, plenty of sunshine. It's going to allow temperatures to really begin climbing up. We could even see a return to the triple digits as well as those upper 90s as we head into your Friday and as well going in towards your weekend as well. So it's going to be, again, a hot weekend in store. And one of the things you can do to kind of cool down with the weekend well, you could always go to our website, ContraValleyHomePage.com, under the contest tab and enter your chance to win a water slide. That's certainly one way to stay cool. You're definitely going to want it for this weekend. Both Saturday and Sunday could be seeing temperatures return to the triple digits. Breezy winds out of the southwest getting bringing more of that warm air. And it will stay in the upper 90s and low 100s going into next week. Winning with the weather is sponsored by Concho Valley ER. Get a text.